Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play. Excuse me, Dragon Age 2. So, seeing a little bit of different. Uh, we got Meryl with us today. She'll be a more uh, prominent focal point from here on end. So we're gonna do Dupuis. We're just kind of taking this one quest at a time. I may do more. I may do less. This one, I'm just trying to get the really long quests out of the way. So there are quite a few of those. So here's Dupuis' estate. Really close to Fenris's mansion, actually. So this is where we will get beset by demons right off the bat. Yep. You'll also notice that, oh, um, we actually forgot to take our specialization last episode, so let's do that real quick. Obviously we have Force Mage, but we're not putting any points in that. I also took a point in Spirit Bolt. I also picked up a couple uh, companion quests, so we will be going and doing those at some point. Not sure when. So we can either do Blood Mage, which gives us a little bit more health, which we may want, or... Spirit Healer, which gives us a little bit more mana. I don't know why it says mana slash stamina. That's kind of silly. We actually should go for the more mana, so. So, yep, we have Meryl with us. Uh, just for a little bit of a change of pace, I know I mentioned I would do it. And we need to get her some, some friend points. We don't have too much invested in her. She will be a major person in the third act, and in between, I suppose. I will probably take her into one of the DLC. But she won't be coming for the last one. So demons, obviously blood magic is here. Uh, Gaskar, thank you kindly for your last ship, and it arrived in almost perfect condition. The requested payment is on its way. Please use the artifact with care. The creature can be difficult to control, even for experienced mages. Gasgard went to a great deal of trouble for something. So Gasgard is a mage, obviously. Um, we're not going to find anything important, really. But yeah. Um, there's our rage demon. It's kind of chilling. Obviously, uh, we don't necessarily have a problem. I'm gonna start pumping up my damage. Because damage is always good. This is in regards to your inquiry for missing mages. I'd like to remind you that the duty of seeking out missing mages, if there were any to begin with, would fall to the Templars of Starkhaven, not a minor nobleman from Kirkwall. I would also like to take this opportunity to remind you that the Circle of Magi as a whole does not welcome casual inquiries about the mages in its care. First Enchanter, Radic. Okay. Um, I, I hope with Dragon Age 3 we will see a bit more focus on the Kunari, and you'll, you'll see what I mean. When this is all said and done, um, I doubt it. It's gonna take. I, I well, I shouldn't spoil it because it actually pertains to this, the end of this game, pretty highly. So, so here we go. So he appears He's to be the killer. Bad. He isn't. You're not. You're not. We're him. not him. Shit. I. I know what this looks like, but I didn't you hurt didn't? her. So the wild-eyed hysteria is just for show, then. <clears throat> You don't understand. Someone is after her. I had to keep her mm -hmm. safe. I don't know why you're here, but there's a killer I out know. there. And I think he's playing us both. Just... just let me explain. All right. We'll see if you can talk yourself out of this. I love you, Eric. It wasn't me, it was the one-armed man. Several years ago, my sister was murdered. The bastard's now in Kirkwall, killing again. The same way he killed my sister. 
It starts with a bouquet of white lilies. He sends them to each new victim. Alessa was going to be next. She's kind of homely, don't you think? I took her, so he'd have to come to me. I was finally going to face my sister's killer, but then you showed up. We didn't scare him off. He's lying! He hurt me! Oh, hush. I've explained this. I need your blood to track you down. If he took you, it was for your protection. Let go of me! The crying didn't She'd sound... Go straight to the city guard. They'll ruin everything. I'm sorry, but... Nice story, but I don't buy it. No. I've worked too hard. I mean, hard. he's not wrong. He there is someone out there like killing this. people. He's not the killer. But at the same time... Um, he's gonna run away. We're just, uh... Getting the mage out of the equation. Let's get Meryl. I've specced her for AoE as well. And that's how you do it. So yeah, Fear Bolt's a pretty good damaging spell. We're taking the more direct. It's, it's not all that powerful just yet, but it will get more powerful because it bypasses our. So obviously his how many did you get Hawk is a reference to Legolas and Gimli. Uh, Varric makes a lot of movie jokes. The one arm man thing is a movie reference. I don't know what movie though. But it is. I I promise. Ooh. Out of my way, ladies. So here's Mary this apology. He said, my humble apologies for recent events. The Templar Emmerich has been reprimanded for his wrongful accusations and for rousing suspicions within the city guard. I've led to the raid on your estate. I will see that he is restrained in the future. An apology from Kirkwall's Iron Lady? That must have been a first. I don't know why they didn't proc him mentioning anything about that, but cool. So he's funneling us into where he wants us to go is right here. We'll fight some more demons and some more chests, and I probably will keep this where uh, this episode short, which is okay. Um, this is a... I, I have a reason for not talking to our mother. It's the only way I think that the, the logical conclusion of this quest will go. She's a little bit neglected by her son because we have more important things to do, and She's her own lady, but uh, she did get some white lilies, which, you know, know what that means. And we unfortunately don't have any way to step in. So, we're not, we're just not concerned about our mom's love life. The only way, oh, we died. Crap. Uh, that's the first time Hawk has actually gone down. We're gonna switch to Meryl, though. Ooh, uh... Yeah, that's the first time that's happened. I was too busy talking. Not too... not, uh... Oh, Meryl, your damage is less than desirable. But that's okay, we're almost done. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, oops. I know I don't have any amulets or rings on our character, but uh, that's okay. So we'll be a little bit more careful and not blab so much. So Gaskar Dupuis is in there. Um, I know I said I'll be more careful. We're gonna get him out of the equation as quickly as possible. And then we're gonna come out here and bring everything with us in our typical tactic. Gaskar Dupuis is a mage and a blood mage. We're just going to keep an eye on that uh, red circle. And it's not so hot in my apartment anymore. I opened up some windows. 
Finally, it's been nice to, to get to do that, and now we're gonna go and kick the crap out of the Death Guard. So, Meryl will also be able to help us keep the more obnoxious enemies down the bottom. And we've killed him. It was gonna happen regardless of what path we took. So, I think we're done here. So we're gonna go talk to Emmerich, and... I will probably go and do our two companion quests. One is with Meryl, and one is with Fenris. And no matter what we say to Fenris, he's going to be a grumpy jerk. So. And we're going to leave. That is the plan. But I should really pay attention to where I'm headed, because... Yep, just. And vials of blood. I think these have been used in blood magic. Thank you, Meryl. Got his funny hat, and we are now uh, gonna go back to Emmerich. But first. Oh, yeah, we don't get. Since Fenris' mansion is so close by. We found a book called the Book of Shartan. It was the slave that was Andraste's first prophet. He should like this. But he's not. And you'll see why. Hi, Fenris. I, have I bet you, for do. you It, It's a book. I see your eyesight is still working fine. The book is by Shartan, the elf who helped Andraste free the slaves. You know about him, right? Of course I know about him. What do you tell An me? An asshole? From? I certainly didn't learn from books, though. Do you think they teach slaves to read? It's not too we'll late to learn, Fenris. Is that what this is? See, Let's no matter what we say, he's to read. Ugh. Ignore me. You are not responsible for my deficiencies. I do appreciate your gift. I've always wanted to learn more of Shartan. Perhaps this Grr, is my chance. Growl, anger. No matter what you say, or how you say it, Fenris is a moody bitch. That's okay. That's okay. We're gonna go talk to Meryl now. Hello, Meryl. Oh, we all got a hollow, which is like a, a sheep elk mix. I've got something for you. They're sacred to the elves. Ah, oh, look at the eyes. Ooh, did you get this from my Yes, island? I did actually. Mythal, did I miss some important occasion? I'm so sorry. I'll make it up to you. I promise. I think I missed the elvish sign for this present induces terrible guilt. I'll shop more carefully in the future. I... Of course. You're just being thoughtful. I sure am trying. No one has ever given me a present before. Useful things. Tools or clothes. Because I needed them, not... Well, that's because. sad. Maseranus. I'll find a good place for this. So we should get a little bit of friendship. Yep. And by a little bit, I mean... Pretty good amount. So, we're going to go to Prime Suspects and turn it in, and uh, we'll end the episode there. Come here, Emmerich, you old... Oh. Aren't you Hawk? Emmerich left Excuse not me. long ago. He said you'd arrange to meet tonight. Did I tell him that? I must have completely forgotten. Don't you remember sending no. this message? I didn't say. So, Emmerich's this. dead. You didn't? Strange. That's not a good sign. Well, I don't know. Emmerich's been acting strangely for months. It's probably no, just it's not. He's dead. <laughs> so the answer is yes. And that means the blind alley. So 
strange sound going on outside of my apartment. Share it with three other people, so it could be one of them. I don't particularly know them. I think it is a blender. But who's to say? I don't know. I don't think it show up in the recording. Hopefully it doesn't show up in the recording. Okay, we've got a bro. Desire Demon, never good sign. I've been, I knew it was coming, of course. That's why I held back all my AoE spells. And why she already cast all of them. Can't see through the fire. We'll back up Meryl because she's pretty vulnerable right now. Please stop punching me in the face. I think it's time to heal. She doesn't even she doesn't get ever get the chance to heal, unfortunately. Or to learn heal. Only Anders is the other character is the only other character who gets that spell. And mages are the only ones who can. Uh so. I'll deal with it. And we are out of mana, which is okay. Some mage sent that thing here to kill him. Why would anyone? Got too close. Oh, Maker, the murders. Emmerich was right. Nice he haircut. Too close. He Did you use a ball? A man named Gascard Dupuis. Did he do this? I killed Gascard. Then who's the, the real creature? killer? Whoever did this is a dangerous apostate that Meredith will want found. I will see to it. Cool personally. for you, Moria. My guardsmen will find Alessa, the woman who was with Gaston. No, you won't. She might still be She's in dead. Thank you for your help in this matter. If you learn anything more, please come to me. So, we finished that quest. We almost leveled up. Um, I think we're going to return to our mansion. And that was where that is where we'll end it. And then next episode will be the environs around Kirkwall. It's probably the Wounded Coast. Yep, the Wounded Coast. We can't actually do anything on Sundermount just yet. We don't use hot keys, I use my mouse to click on them. So here we are. I don't that's weird. Good to see you again. One more doggy trip. Who's a funny boy? You are. Yes, you are. What a strange animation from Macarius. A new letter on your desk of Oh, does it? Let's do that. Inside job. I found a lead on our cargo thefts and urgent and have urgent need of your expertise. Please meet me in High Town Market during business hours. Uh, we'll actually go and do that, and that is where we'll end it. This was the Bone Pit. Um, we'll actually take Meryl, Varric, and Aveline. And we will go and talk to Hubert. Or Hubert. Silly French language and not pronouncing the last letter in... The outside of your house is so... You know the Tetris family businesses are registered in your cousin Elman's name? You don't say. But I can't find any record of you having a cousin Elmond. I'll introduce you sometime. He's a little on the shy side. That Good. Carry on. Oh, thank you for... Uh, basically, the gist of that was Varric's cousin is imaginary. And, uh... Oh, shut up. So we're gonna see if they have anything. Nope. Come replace your old crap. How nice. That's for Sebastian. Um, I don't think Hubert has anything for us. Nope. And Hubert. You got I sure letter. did. You've been gone a while. I thought you had things under control. I told you I would handle this. And I did. Now, 
After a year of raids on our shipments, I finally caught one of the culprits. One of our miners, Sabine. Is that how you pronounce that? Information. Do you know him? He claims to be from your hometown yeah, in I don't know him. I would like you to get this festering sore to divulge who is behind the theft. When you are ready, I will bring Sabine to you. Who is this man? I would not expect you to recall every piss pot from your past. I don't. That's the problem with being a big fish in a small pond. I could never tell the little fish apart. Oh, <laughs> well, that wasn't very nice. Well, he brags to his fellows that he grew up with you in Lothering. I've other things to deal with first. Return to me soon. This is a matter of great urgency. I'm with you, man. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm with you. But we're gonna save and uh, come back to that another time. As always, guys, thanks for watching.